Let's assume we're going to put one over here. We'll have it there. Now, where are we going to put houses? Because I'm sure I'm going to want some houses. Probably that way around. And which house do we want? If we're going to run a road there, is that where we want the bridge, I wonder? Yeah, it would make sense. So... Let's just check that's where the... Yeah, so it's sort of halfway across the grey area. Bridge to there. And then we'll bring a road up to here, down to there, and then we can develop this area. So once I've got my roads in place, uh, uh, we can do the rest on, on the fly while we're working. Do those roads meet up there? Yeah, they do. That's good. That'll do fine. Yeah, they... Do you know what I just thought? Let's not have that quite... Have it like that instead. And storage barn. Storage barn is really important. I'm yeah, I think that's a better position. Because the storage barn but I don't want them building it until this house is ready for the fishermen. Instead of just building more houses, I could do something with this area and something more with that area and have a bit of an overlap between them. Is that iron? Certainly looks like iron. It is. Well, I can go and get that. Let's just zoom out a second and have a look. If we had... Let's say a hunter. So if we had a hunter... Um, somewhere like there. Well, they would pick up the other side. So we could put one there like that. And if we had one there, and then we had another one sort of here... I mean, there's a large overlap between them, but... Uh, I think we're going to want to... 
squeeze as much out of this place as we possibly can eventually. And it does mean that we kind of get all of this area here on the edge of the, the mountain. Which, if we had it down there, we're, we're missing a few bits on the edges. Hmm. So, although we can't build around here, they can walk. So, it is... and the animals were walking around here, so... And it's... I think it's the same here as well. The areas where we can't build, they still get animals, so... Probably worth it for a hunter to have something within his range. I don't think animals come all the way up here though. Hmm. Yeah, there. Well, I think a hunter has one of the biggest areas. Let's have a look at gatherers. Yeah, Gatherer has a much smaller catchment area. So if we were to put Gatherer there... I think they do? See, the crossover would be just to the other side of the barn. Whereas a Hunter... would be a little bit further than just the other side of the barn. happen with foresters. So if we had a forester here, just the other side of the barn again. So that would suggest that if we're gonna have Probably best getting the hunter as far this way as possible. Let's get them going. It, that seems to be. Because more food would be a good thing. They got a stockpile there, they don't need this other one here for this guy. Three labourers, someone can go down a mine. Is there anything we're short of? Be nice to have more stone cutters, but it's not urgent. Brewers are no use to us. We can always throw in another herbalist. Oh look, 41. Oh my word! Oh, 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 oh! We've just reached... I don't know when this happened. We've just gone over 50. Um... So early winter when we had those two children born. So we've now got a population of 51. All we've got to do now is to maintain this population above 51 uh, for a number of years, I can't remember how many, and we'll do it. So let's have a look at the achievements. And we're looking for the mountain men achievement. Right, 20 years. So, we've got to maintain the population at 50, above 50, for 20 years now. So, when we hit year 40, as long as we haven't dropped below 50 in that time period, we'll have our first achievement. Okay.
that's um I think we'll need a lot more than well we're on 52 now I think we need a lot more people than that to be sure that we're gonna make this achievement because oh they can start dropping like flies at any point I'm thinking now we've got one hunter there we should think about where we're gonna put our next hunter We want our next hunter to be reasonably high up and a little bit over, a little bit towards the water, probably about there maybe. Oh, oh I see, yeah, yeah, we need to appoint some hunters, don't we? Now if I turn that that way around, I can line it up with that road. That looks alright there. Okay, so let's take somebody out the mine. We'll take somebody else out the mine and we'll add another hunter. Oh, Spence has died. I remember Spence when he was just a baby. Build a gatherer. Hmm. Now I think gatherers can only gather where wood, where forests grow. So let's put gatherer in there. Oh, pressed is dead. Pressed. I thought pressed died earlier. We're gonna do let's take a kill by a cave in. Take another stone cutter off. Okay, food's going back up. It's not where I'd like it to be. And now it's coming back down. Our population is barely above 50. 51. But tools are above 50. That's a good sign. If I can get another house built, it will make everybody more efficient. We do seem to have had a better deal with the iron since I just kept more labourers. Okay, so now it's dropping down to zero, but we've we're back down. Oh gosh, what's that? Uh, we keep labourers at least at two. Keep the miners up there at 13 if we can. Keep us in tools. Um, and now I want them to build another house. And I do want it down here. They look like they need a diagonal path, but I think I might be blocking that off a little bit. Let's see, what shall we have? Maybe we'll have that one. A 
child, I think. Did we drop below 50? Or did we drop down to 50 and now we're back up to 51? Maybe? Hmm, not sure. Be good to have a... This, will, this house should take us into a safer zone anyway. It's only only one year has passed since we first hit 50. So if we um, if we fell below 50, it wouldn't be 52. It wouldn't be a big restart. gatherer has just moved in from somewhere else on the map where we had yeah we had gatherers doubled up over here okay we've now got a population of 53 54 these people are going to need feeding. Okay, let's have a look at... roads here. So we want a road to go in front of the hunter. And back here we want uh, another gatherer. Oh good, Victoria is an adult. Okay, so... If we were to take a road, I'd say it was up the side of that barn there. That's probably pretty good. So we'll have the gatherer there, and on the other side of the gatherer. A forester. Mm, we're going to have to have another. We're going to have to have some housing up here. Fine. 